All right, guys, good afternoon. I am coming to you from Haines City, Florida, where they just put a new Arby's in uh, earlier this year. And we're here, we're gonna try some items off the menu that we've never tried before, and let's go make some memories. All right, so we got our food to go, and we're gonna, I guess, do a car review. Worked the last time with Jolly Bee, so we're gonna try it again this time. Um, what do we wanna try first? The milkshake, since it's kinda melting already? Yeah, and it we drank Florida. a little bit. <laughs> they, they add whipped cream if you want. And it's um, coffee and mocha. Mm. It's delicious. I've actually never had a Jamocha shake before because I don't like coffee. So let me try it. Better than I expected, but still not my... Uh, just give me chocolate. <laughs> So Arby's now has crinkle fries that are new to the menu, so let's try those. Those are good. I like it. These are pretty good. Mm, they have a crisp. Yeah. A crunch on the outside, soft on the inside. Mm -hmm. These are good. Mm -hmm. I feel like crinkle fries, these are pretty good. Yeah. Well, these are not for everybody, but I personally like the curly fries. Some people really like the stringy ones like this. The thicker ones I don't like as much. I like the smaller, crunchy ones. Yeah, the curly fries have been on Arby's menu forever. And they're seasoned. Mm. <laughs> okay, so we're about to try it. And we cut it into thirds so we can all try it. Come on. Oh, whoa. That's awesome. Wow. Wow. Oh, yeah, this is good. The sauce they have, the cheesy sauce, makes it really creamy and the rib, prime rib is really tender. Peppers are good. The only complaint I have is on my piece, I only have one pepper. Mm. Kind of light on the peppers there. Mm. But the flavor is really good. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow. I'm amazed. Delicious. Shout out to BB, BB's Adventures, because her and cameraman went and got this, and I saw their vlog about it, and I said, man, we should go to Arby's and try this, so. Thanks for the tip and the idea. This is a good sandwich. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put a link to BB's channel down in the description down below so you guys can go check out their video about Arby's too, as well as their content. The roll is really good too. Yeah, it's very fresh tasting, soft. Mm -hmm. We still have six sliders to try. try. <laughs> we went in thinking we were gonna get five because we knew there was five and the guy's like, actually we have a sixth. Corned beef. Mm -hmm. What the hey, let's try it too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, I want to try this one and get it out of the way because I don't like spicy and I'm sure buffalo is going to be spicy. The buffalo chicken one? It smells spicy. <laughs> so this is their slider. The buffalo chicken one. I don't even know if I know all five of the, what they are. Do you? Yeah. We went into Arby's planning on using a coupon for the sliders to get them for a dollar, but the Arby's that we went to here in Haines City from two to five every day, including weekends, does the sliders for only a dollar. I do I buy it? Yeah, I wanted to it. get the, the sauce, but the sauce is more like in the middle. Take it back from the middle if you can. Just don't drop it on your clothes. Oh. Bless you. Got it. Let me clean the camera. <laughs> it's spicy. It's spicy? Uh, How is it? Spicy. Spicy? <laughs> mm, that's what water's for. All right, let me try. Daddy, no. Save yourself. <laughs> a lot of people like spicy, so it's gonna be like buffalo and spicy. This is good. <laughs> See? <laughs> I don't love it, but it's good. Once again, the buns. Very fresh tasting. Yeah. Soft. Okay, so this What's one's next? what, turkey? Yeah, the turkey slider. Is there anything on it besides turkey? I don't turkey? like turkey. <laughs> like this. Is it just like turkey it. and bun? And che Ooh, cheese. Oh, and cheese, okay. Turkey um, reminds me of the turkey sandwiches from school. Mm -hmm. See, the thing is, I'm probably gonna love this one because mm -hmm. I like turkey. I like turkey too. The meat is tender. <laughs> Come on, you <laughs> cheater. <laughs> For a dollar, I was saying how you could get like, well, this was this was because I used a coupon, but they have a smaller snack shake where they have small drink, uh, drinks and the sliders are a dollar from two to five and the uh, small fries as well. 
I think so, cookies too, or a dollar. I don't know, but either way, for like four dollars, you could get two sliders, a fries, and a drink, and it's a meal. You know, so I think it's it's good. Yeah, good cheap eats. Yeah. All right, so let me try the turkey one. use a little sauce it's a little dry but I like the flavor of the turkey but the turkey is very tender mm -hmm. so I don't feel like it, it like feels dry in your mouth no I mean I could use a little bit of sauce but that's I don't what I mean for a little, it, for like, a little like a little maybe a little bit of RB sauce on yeah, it yeah but good. at least it's not dry <laughs> so six annoying. sliders we're on slider number three and this one's the corned beef I think which also comes with cheese so it's the bun the was it come with Swiss I don't know can't tell it doesn't look like the corned beef you make no very good. Oh, super yummy. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> Arby's does have the good meats, I think. I, I, they, small bites, big flavor, it says right here. Ah. This one looks dry. I'll be honest. That's just the chicken, right? The chicken it's just and, chicken. Chicken and cheese. Chicken and Is cheese, and there's one? no sauce, and honestly, it looks a little bit dry. And Is that the sauce. fourth one? This is the fourth one. I mean, I guess if I try this, just even even just taking it out, it, it felt dry. At least it's a good flavor. I'm surprised. I thought it was going to be dry and less flavorful, but it was good. What do you think? It's pretty good? It's super good. Right, like it's missing a little sauce, which I'm guessing you could ask them for something maybe. Mm -hmm. But it, it, has it has good flavor. So we have two sliders left, both are roast beef actually. I didn't know that the only difference was that one has jalapenos and the other one doesn't. But I'll show you. What is it, diced? They're like diced, maybe even grilled. Like they're darkened. Okay, spread them oh. out a little. No, that's fine. Somebody's gonna get a bad bite. <laughs> I'll take this one. I like it. <clears throat> it's like I know that this is what they're known for, but roast beef is my least favorite. It's awesome. It's my favorite. Your favorite sandwich? The roast beef is from Arby's. Yeah, I love the roast beef. Beef and cheddar is the best sandwich to me. This one's good. I could just do without the jalapeno. This is the other roast beef that doesn't have the jalapeno, so it's gonna be similar. We did get packs of Arby sauce. sauce yeah. Gotta add some. Mm. Where is the Arby sauce? Mm -hmm. It's not in there. Maybe the turnover bag. Yeah. I think she gave us three. Same as the jalapeno one, just missing the jalapeno. The touch of the jalapeno I thought was good though, as long as mm -hmm. it's not too strong. Like mm -hmm. that kick I like it better than the jalapeno. Do you like this one better? Yeah. Okay. So all we have left now to try is the turnovers. Two of the We ordered the whole menu, people. I'm already right. stuffed. No, I'm probably am. I'm full too. Oh my god, What's don't this lose one? It. This one's apple, right? If you drop the turnover, there may be fighting involved. <laughs> <laughs> Which one's that one, apple? Mm -hmm. And the gravy looks delicious. Mommy, don't say goodbye. Good flavor again. They're very fresh. They're not stale. This location, I'm impressed with the food. I mean, I don't know if they're always like that or we just got really lucky because it was that time of the day where we just got all the fresh food. I don't know. It was all very fresh, very tasty. I do find that, that the turnovers are a little bit on the sweet side. Like I like them a little softer probably from the icing, but to each their own. I, I would even, I would like it with more glaze, to be honest. Did you have the sweet tooth? I do. The cherry? Yeah. Okay, this one I know I'm gonna like. Cherry. Go in. This time I'm going in for fourth bites. Something I could, I mean, it's one of those pastries where I feel like I could do without the icing just to be able to taste the fruit. I'm probably going in for fifth bites on this one, people. 
I'm hidden behind the paper. You cannot see that I'm doing. <laughs> yeah, that's good stuff. Yeah. I can't taste the cherry very much. No. See, because the icing is so strong that it covers the flavor of the fruit. Icing's still delicious. It is. But it's Ooh, but like to me, it's flavor. like a cream cheese icing would be just like the icing on the cake. Uh, or the icing on the pastry. Uh, uh, <laughs> anyway. Out of all of it, my favorite is probably the cheesecake. I think everything was really good. I, it's hard to pinpoint what the one thing I, I would like was because everything was good. Everything was fresh tasting. Every, there was a few things that weren't my favorite, but all in all, I think everything was good. Yeah, everything was very I good, was, very you fresh. Know, even for something like the jalapeno bites that I don't like, I didn't like the sauce. But I mean, like that's just a personal choice. We had to wait. My maybe, shake was delicious. We did wait a long time. Maybe ten food. or fifteen minutes for the food, but it's worth it when you get all fresh food. It was so, so fresh, yeah. See um, all these Arby's commercials, and they say we got the meats. We tried the meats, and they were all very good. Yeah. Very good. Um. So yeah, hopefully your local Arby's has that cheese stick. I know it's a limited time, so I would rush out and get that before they take it off the menu. It's a little pricey at the six dollar mark, but. I would pay it. Yeah, it's worth it because it's a big sandwich if you're eating it by yourself. Yeah, that's good. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully, you like this uh, car food review of some other Arby's items that we've never tried before. Um, if you're not subscribed to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below for content like this and other travel stuff. Um, leave us a comment. What's your favorite Arby's menu item? Keep this channel growing. We just hit 1,600 subscribers this morning, and we we're very excited about that. I guess next stop, 1,700, and then closing in on 2000 which is going to be awesome thanks so much for watching you guys we'll see you soon